go. This is the Cape Sands Inn. And this is a place where the roof was taken completely off. A lot of the insulation blown in the backyard, a lot of trees and a lot of the furniture and some of the other area things of the hotel were just blown across the property. And that's where you find WBZ's Bill Shields tonight, which is looking at one of the more iconic damage spots from this storm so far. Bill? You know, Eric, we're standing on the second floor, the balcony, if you will, of the Cape Sands Hotel here in West Yarmouth. Let me show you the roof. Well, what used to be a roof at this hotel? There's about 10 rooms, eight or 10 rooms that are no longer able to have guests in them. When this room came off today, it was just mayhem here. And we interviewed today some of the people that were right in the middle of this. Very scary. Very scary. It started with wind and rain, and suddenly it picked up. So did the roof of this Yarmouth hotel. Seconds later, Charlie Lindemann shot this video. No more roof over eight guest rooms. It looks like the tornado hit the front of the building. We sort of heard the tree crack, and as we turned around, the roof came right off the building. The Cows family was in their room, but suddenly getting rained on. And all of a sudden, the, the, the room was flooded. But um, it was the scariest thing we ever witnessed. It was terrifying. It was really loud, but I was looking out the window when it happened. So I just saw the roof come up and then like the light broke. And so we ran into the back. Enough was enough when the roof ended up in pieces on the grass. Yeah, I want to come back next year. No problem. <laughs> OK, guys, thank you for today. It's enough. A tornado? The National Weather Service is now investigating. Whatever it was, though, wreaked havoc in Yarmouth. It was crazy, and there was a lot of damage up and down Route 28, uh, trees down, power lines, uh, some structural damage. All in a matter of minutes. Uh, minutes. Roads across the Cape were flooded here in Bourne and in North Falmouth as the storm tracked its way east. Early on, we thought it was simply heavy rain and a little bit of wind, but as this developed, the Cape was really whacked, as you heard Eric talk about. It's everywhere from down in Falmouth all the way to Orleans, and Harwich is especially hard hit. But this hotel, well, that's going to take them a while till they can get guests, get this fixed, and get guests back in here. At least another half of the hotel wasn't damaged, so those people are all right, although they're still staring wide-eyed at this. Reporting live from Yarmouth, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Back to you guys.